Hello, Oscillator Sync here. Today I'm really excited to share with you a brand new patch pack for the Korg monologue, which has been released by those fine folks at Korg. This patch pack is maybe a bit different to many other patch packs, because it's actually a set of 30 tweakable drum percussion loops for the monologue. Now if you're thinking, but the monologue isn't a drum machine, then you'd be right. But what the monologue does have is a powerful sequencer that you can use to coax exciting and surprising grooves from this wonderful analog mono synth. I've tried to build patches that walk the line between on one hand being miniature songs that might serve as starting points in your own musical explorations, and on the other I've tried to make patches that love to be tweaked, altered and processed to turn them into something completely new. So let's take a look at some of the patches and explore some of the fun ways to play with them, tweak them and make them your own. The quickest and arguably most fun way to interact with the patches is just to grab hold of the controls in the monologue and tweak them either to find new sounds and colours, or to create dynamic changes in real time. A lot of the controls will do something usable and interesting, but don't worry if you stray too far, you can always just reload the patch and get back to tweaking. Another way you can tweak the patches is to interact with the sequences themselves. Turning steps on or off, whether in notes or motion modes, can yield new rhythms and vibes. In a lot of the patches, many of the steps are switched off by default, but I've programmed some of them in ready to turn back on. Of course, there's nothing to stop you from adding new notes to the sequences, or changing the ones that are there to better suit your compositions. You can also dig into the motion sequences to see what makes them tick. Check out which parameters have been sequenced in the sequence menu and then program and alter those values on a step-by-step -step basis by switching to the motion mode, holding down a step and turning the knob. Try replicating the settings on another step if you want to use the same sounds to make a brand new beat. Of course, the monologue is a synth that loves external processing, so why not try adding reverb? Or perhaps you want to try a different flavour of distortion. Whether you're using hardware or software plugins, processing the patches can open up brand new sonic ideas. Anyway, I hope you enjoy using and tweaking these patches as much as I enjoyed making them. I really encourage you to explore how you can use the sequencer on the monologue to create beats and rhythms because it's just such an exciting way to get sounds that you'd never arrive at on a conventional drum machine. As always, enjoy your synths, take care, and I'll see you again soon.